Hi guys, welcome back to another video. And today I'm gonna to be showing you a cheap $200 PC build for kids. This PC is great if your kid is just looking to play like Minecraft, Roblox, or Fortnite. Anything along those lines, this PC will get the job done. So without further ado, let's get started. Also, just a disclaimer before we start this video, all the products that I mentioned in this video will be linked in the description down below if you wanna go buy them. So let's get on with this build. So the desktop we're using for this PC build today is a HP Elite 8200. And I got this off of Facebook for $100, but it came with this monitor right here. You can find cases like these on Facebook or eBay from $70 to $80. So if we take a look inside the case, the graphics card we're using is a GeForce GTX 1650. This is the NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1650 video graphics card from MSI. It is the low profile design and is the OC edition, which means it is overclockable. So if we take a look at the back, so this graphics card is a PCI Express 16X graphics card with four gigs of RAM. And this graphics card has one HDMI and one DVI output. So this graphics card supports the MSI Afterburner software, which allows you to do high-end video editing, graphics, and gaming, which includes an application that you can use to do stuff on the road. And we have eight gigs of DDR3 RAM right here. You can get them pretty cheap off of eBay anywhere from 30 to $40 probably. So the processor we're using is an i5 third gen. It has a turbo quad core that runs at 2.5 gigahertz and can be clocked up to 3.1 gigahertz. But also with this build, we got a cheap PNY SSD. It's 120 gigs, but that was just to make the PC run faster. Originally, this hard drive is a 720 gigabyte hard drive and that came with the desktop itself. So with everything together, for the graphics card, the extra RAM, and the SSD. If you can get it for pretty cheap, it'll probably cost $250. That's just a conservative estimate. But if you did downgrade your graphics card to like a GTS 1050, then the cost would probably go down about $20 to $30 or so, depending on where you get it from. So the FPS we got on Roblox, Minecraft, and Fortnite all together, it'd be around 40 to 50 FPS. Also, this PC isn't just limited to video games. It can run all the Adobe programs and other editing softwares like Vegas Pro. You can also use it as just a general workstation for like for schoolwork, homework, whatever you wanna use it for. Also, this PC can be used for streaming with the Streamlabs app or the OBS software. So maybe if your kids wanna stream your games to YouTube or Twitch, for that, this PC can get the job done. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you haven't, like and subscribe so you don't miss out on more daily uploads like this. And also comment down below if you have any questions because I reply to all the comments that come in. So thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you in the next one.